Hi guys, today I'm at the super nice construction site where we planned and will install the Loxon product, working together with a local electrician. And I can show you now the wiring and all the interesting part, how a Loxon project looks like in the making. This project is in Bavaria and we are working worldwide. Here you see there will be the space for the cars, there will be an electric car charger, there is a photovoltaic system. So of course the energy management is a big topic here. Here will be the entrance, there will be a door with an electric motor. The access to the house will be either with fingerprint or in this case with the NFC code touch and there will be an intercom. Here you see is a small bathroom, a small toilet. In Austria and Germany we typically put the wires onto, on the floor. There will be an underfloor heating system, water-based as well, and there will be concrete poured over it. And here is the technical room, and there you see lots of cables coming. A detailed video on the cabling will follow soon. This project also has a ventilation system, so upstairs you will see the piping. Here you see the open kitchen and dining area. There is nice big glass windows, there is electrical shutters outside. We have different points where there will be a Loxon push button, but there is a bus cable used. Then there is one for here as well. This touch inside will be used for the outside area. There will be RGBW color light, normal light and infrared heating. Here in the kitchen as well, we control the kitchen LEDs. We have another push button here. There will be switched sockets for the coffee machine. And there will be a kitchen island here as well with a nice RGBW color LED on the floor. Here is the dining area. We will have a dimmable light on top here. Here you see the nice ceiling is made out of wood and it will stay like this, of course. That's why we will use surface mounted 24 volt PWM spots. In this project, it was a bit difficult to mount the speakers. So here we decided to install them in the walls instead of the ceiling. Typically, when you have plastered ceiling, you can use them in the ceiling as well. Here in the living room, there will be different lighting circuits. There will be these spots as well. Here we have some nice hanged 230 LED lamps and there will be a color LED strip on, in the wall with an aluminum profile shining on the ceiling, giving a super nice effect. Also here for the windows, automatic shading based on the sun, because you can imagine that it heats up the room super fast when the sun is like now in summer, then the shade will automatically go down here. Then for the TV, there is, a, there is the option to put an RGBW for the wall as well. There will be LAN, there will be the, norm, the normal stuff like 230 volt, etc. And, and here for the wiring, you see everything is done on the floor as well. Here for the staircase, we will use a 230 volt um, motion sensor for the, for the wall here and up there. There will be LED strips on the sides here, 24 volt for a nice indirect light. And on the ceiling, this will be gone, so this will be open afterwards. They use it now for, for working only. There is a window as well, you can barely reach it, so you can open it electrically with the app as well. It also has a shading built in. Here you see lots of piping. The big white ones is for the ventilation, and all the other ones are for the water or for the electrical components. This will be the bathroom. It's a little difficult in this project because here it's open space. With the window there will be spots mounted as well and here it will be closed afterwards like this and then there will be a speaker built in here. This will be hidden of course, that's why the ceiling will be closed here. And we will have lots of lights, there will be a color LED in the bathroom, so in the shower as well. So we have to use special ones, waterproof ones. And the rest here is bedrooms, a master bedroom. You have here some um, cupboards and stuff and here is the bedroom. We will have presence detection and dimmed light here as well. So if you stay up at night, the presence detector grabs you when you're outside of the bed, then only a slight light will turn on to guide you the way. I hope you could get some impression on how a Loxon project is typically working. Feel free to contact us. We are consulting local electricians worldwide. So here a German electrician done all the wiring based on our planning. We sell the Loxon components and do the programming afterwards. See you in the next one.